Hi friends! Do you know how the fruits and vegetables that we eat grow? Yes? No? Well, today we're going to learn all about plants together. Plants are living things. That means they move and grow just like you and me. Plants come in different shapes and sizes. Some plants are small and some plants are... Yes, big. Some plants are small and some are big. A bean plant is small and an apple tree is big. Some bean plants take about 60 days to fully grow and only grow to about 2 feet tall. Do you know how tall 2 feet is? Yes, that's about as tall as a little baby. An apple tree can take 3 to 8 years to grow and start giving us apples. An apple tree can grow up to 30 feet tall. That can be taller than a house. Have you ever seen seeds inside of a fruit before? Yes? Papayas have seeds. Lemons have seeds. And pomegranates also have seeds. Seeds also come in different shapes and sizes. Acorn, avocado, and peach seeds are big, while tomato seeds, sunflower seeds, and beans are all... Correct! They are small! Tomato seeds will grow into a tomato plant. Sunflower seeds will grow into a sunflower plant. And a bean will grow into a... Yes, a bean plant. All seeds will grow into the same kind of plant that made them. Let's look at some seeds being planted. Let's make a pattern with some seeds. Small, big, small, big, small. What do you think comes next? That's right, big. Do you know how seeds turn into fully grown plants? Hmm, let's learn together. Remember, plants are living things just like you and me. We eat food to grow. Do you know what seeds need to grow? Seeds need wet, soft soil to grow. To get our soil wet and soft, we can water our seeds with a watering can or when it rains, our seeds get water. Seeds also need the right temperature and light to grow. Our seed can get light from the sun. Look, now our seed is growing a tiny root. This is called germination. The root is growing down to collect all the water and minerals our seed needs to grow. Our plant is doing something. Look, it's growing up. Wow, we have a tiny shoot. 
Green leaves grow up from the shoot to collect more light from the sun. Oh, wow! Do you see those earthworms? We need to get them back into the soil. Earthworms make the soil soft and airy so the roots can grow and breathe. Can you find the worm with the uppercase S? If we make the sound of the letter S, the earthworm will find its spot in the soil. Ready friends? Let's make the sound of the letter S. S, S, S. That was amazing! Great job friends! Now, do you see the worm with the uppercase A? Let's make the sound of the letter A together so the earthworm can find its spot in the soil. Ah, ah, ah. Great job! You are amazing! Now there's only one earthworm left. What letter do you see on that earthworm? Yes, that is the uppercase T. Let's make the sound of the letter T so the earthworm can find its spot in the soil. T -t 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 Good job, friends. You helped all the earthworms find their spots in the soil. Now our plant has all the air it needs to grow. Our plant is growing and growing. It is getting bigger and bigger. Now our plant is fully grown. Let's look at some fully grown plants together. A banana plant. An apple tree. A mango tree. This is a watermelon on a vine. A strawberry bush. And a blueberry bush. Even though some plants are big and some are small, they all have the same parts. Let's learn the parts of a plant together. Plants have roots. Roots are like straws that plants use to suck up nutrients from the soil. Roots keep the plants in the soil so they are not blown away by the wind. Plants have stems. Stems carry water from the roots to the leaves and help to hold the plants up. Plants have leaves. Leaves use the sunlight to make the food that plants need to grow. Plants have flowers. Flowers grow new seeds that we can plant or seeds that will fall to the ground and become new plants. Now, let's make a pattern with flowers. Red Red Yellow Red Red What comes next? Yellow! Great job! Let's look at some more fruit trees together. Tangy oranges Sour lemons Sweet peaches Juicy pears Juicy pomegranates Farmer Brown has planted his seeds in the soil But he doesn't know what they need to grow Can you help him figure out what the seeds need to grow? Yes? Do seeds need a blanket to grow? 
No, no, seeds don't need a blanket to grow. Do seeds need water to grow? Yes, you are correct. Seeds do need water to grow. Do seeds need a sandwich to grow? No, no, that's silly. Seeds do not need a sandwich to grow. Do seeds need sunlight to grow? Oh yes, they do. Seeds do need sunlight to grow. Do seeds need milk to grow? I don't think so. Babies need milk to grow. Great job, friends. You helped Farmer Brown figure out what his seeds need to grow. When our seeds become fully grown plants, and the fruits and vegetables are ripe and ready to eat. It's time for picking. Red tomatoes twine around and around. Purple beets grow down. Orange pumpkins vine around and around. Yellow corn grows And green beans wind around and around. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe for new videos. See you soon.